Hello, this is Geo Techland, and today I'm going to be taking a look at the Pine Phone once again with Ubuntu Touch. And I'm going to be testing the experience making phone calls and sending and receiving text messages. So let's take a look. If you like my content, you can subscribe to me on YouTube, PeerTube, and you can follow me on Odyssey. All right, before we get started, I should mention my screen on the Pine phone is cracked. I dropped it twice in the span of 10 minutes, so that's unfortunate. But anywho, here's me dialing my sister. And as you can see, the call itself failed. So for some reason, the Pine phone can't make, you can't make calls on the Pine phone yet. But you'll see in a moment here that you could receive calls. Before I do that though, I'm gonna send a text message to the bro here. And I'm gonna have him give me a call here. What I love about texting on Ubuntu Touch is that it has a built-in autocorrect, which is nice. All right, you can see a little bit the banner or notification banner that I can, uh, that I've received a call. And I just move the button to the side, to the right side, I can receive the call here. And the one downside too is that although I was able to make the call successfully, I could barely hear sound from a distance. So I had to actually pick up the phone to be able to hear him, but the call itself was okay in terms of quality. You know, I even tried pressing the speaker and it didn't really make much of a difference. But anywho, here's me about to receive a text message. And you do get notifications when you receive text messages. And they're a lot louder than the, the call volume. But overall, I guess you could say that the phone, that phone calling on Ubuntu Touch for the Pine phone maybe is uh, about halfway there. One other interesting thing with uh, updates, I guess I'm in, sta in the stable channel and switching to development. It appears to be a little bit buggy when I do that. If I try to go to development mode and then it does look like it tries to pick up an update for the development version, but it kind of just hangs there and sometimes it'll update, sometimes it won't work. One thing of note, with this latest version of Ubuntu Touch for the Pine phone is that scrolling is a lot smoother than it's ever been and comparing it to other Linux distros for the Pine phone, the performance here is the smoothest um, out of all. Flipping the phone to landscape mode works pretty smooth. But otherwise, texting and receiving messages is okay. Phone calling is incomplete. But overall, the performance of the of Ubuntu Touch on the Pine Phone looks great. As you can see, Ubuntu Touch on the Pine Phone is getting better overall, especially when it comes to performance. And keep in mind, this OS and all the other OSs, they're all very much in beta software, and they all do things better than each other. But overall, they're all improving, and it's good to see it trending upwards. Even the Pine Phone itself is also considered in beta hardware. So keep that in mind when watching these videos. And if you like my content, please like, share, subscribe, and I will see you all next time.